<laughs> Find them all. Hello, happy Morning. Monday. Afternoon, whatever it is. Yeah, could be afternoon. It, it is afternoon. Who am I my, kidding? My brain's not functioning. Oh my, well, we're guys. off to a great start. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome to Assemble, the season three, episode two. Mm -hmm. Yes. And my thing just turned black. So, oh, there we're back. Oh, there we go. <laughs> all right. It's really weird watching yourself when there's a delay. So. It, it is. We're it's at Sarah's to house track. today. I'm off my heart meds, so yep. if I say something stupid, it's because. And if of I that. stop, it's to resuscitate her, so you know, it's all good. She's gonna have her little procedure on Thursday, yeah. so she's gonna be off her meds for a few days prior to that, and then she'll be back to life. Hopefully. No, she will be. Come on. Come well, on. Well, we're gonna see what happens, because I am, I'm always a little bit more pragmatic about it when going into a surgery with it. You don't know how you're gonna feel right afterwards. You're gonna feel so. like crap. Well, I know Pretty that. <laughs> How long I'm going to feel like crap is what's up. So, <laughs> right? Right. This so today we're actually going to be using the Flower Shower Bundle. Yay! So this is this cute little stamp set with the umbrella and some flowers and stuff in it. And then matching dies that go with it. I love it when we use a bundle because we automatically get dies. Yeah. Yay. Yay, yay. So... Okay, let's and get to it. Miss Becky gets to pull today. No, hey, if you like this video, you like what you're seeing, guys, make sure you share it with your friends. Please. And if you have a lot of, hear a lot of snorting, it's not, <laughs> I promise I don't have a pig in the room. It's my pug, Sierra. She's down at our feet. We're giving this a try. Yes, she's, so. she's assembling today. Okay, pattern, printed paper. We're okay. off to a good start. Washi tape. Okay. You know I don't really like that, right? I just poured it. Wait, that's two. Wait, wow. Did you refold all of these? Oh hell no. <laughs> Put it back. Uh -uh. <laughs> yes. No. We are. We have she's nothing cheating already. To use. We're in, we're in episode two, and she's cheating. All right. It was modeling paste. What the hell am I gonna do with modeling paste? Figure it out. And then the last one I drew is pencils. So we have Which washi we need because yeah. there's coloring images. So washi tape, printed paper, pencils, and modeling paste. Okay. <laughs> she says so confidently. Do you have some modeling paste I can use? Yes, I do. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Let's gather up some things. Okay. Um, what are you going after first? Bunch of paper. Okay, I'll go after the one you're not using. Modeling paste. What does one do the with modeling paste? Opened. You guys start thinking about modeling paste. What do you do with it? This is what Sarah's gonna do with it. You didn't draw stencil. You, we draw modeling paste. You get to pull something that goes with it. She changes the rules all the time. I did not. That has been the rule all along. That if you draw it, you draw something, or you get to use something that makes it work. Well, Nice try, Wrong. though. Wrong. Wrong. I like how you change the rules when I'll it benefits just, you. Listen, <laughs> why would you change the rules if it didn't benefit you? I mean, let's get real about that one. Okay, so um, cardstock. Let's see. I I don't need any cardstock, but I'm going to use this I have very limited amounts of washi, too. That I have never used before. and modeling paste there is we got sparkle that's all we got okay 
There, well, okay, so if you want to use a retired nope. washi. Nope. Okay, that's the only other thing I got right nope. now. Nope. All right. it shows up. Okay. All right, let's get started here. I'm going to take all the stamps I need first, and you can have what's left over. Don't glare at me. The people can see I'm you. I'm not glaring at you. <laughs> well, maybe she's silently cussing. I'm not sure what that was. <laughs> Hang on just a minute, I'm gonna switch you around. Okay. I am going to switch you guys around also, so hold on. Hello, Alyssa. You hoard washing tape? Nice to use stencils with it, you say, or add texture to your background. What background? <laughs> okay, I don't know. I should probably figure that out because I need to do that first, right? Because it has to dry. Hang on, let me plug in my microphone before Siri. I'm not getting any help. They're throwing out suggestions that I don't understand. Because I don't know what to do with modeling paste. What, is it super thick or is that the so one that's shiny? Sarah, hmm? is that the one that's super thick or is that the one that's shiny? It's the thick. Mm. Dangity dang dang. It's, so depending on what you're using with it, it can come with a couple different names with it. So it can be texture paste, Modeling paste, embossing okay, paste. Okay, so I have this this new one, but um, I also have... Ours happens to be called modeling paste. Oh my gosh. So I'm just spreading a really thin layer of this across here. And I want to make sure I'm getting it in all the Hold on, guys. I didn't go anywhere. Crevices. I just have to find my stuff. I had to put it up on a shelf. Okay, here we are. I have that one. I have a boy dog, and I told Becky that she probably ought to put her stuff. Okay, now, guys, you know that I'm not a real brave stamper. Experienced, but not brave. So we're going to do it our way. We're probably not going to do it the correct way, but what else is new? Hold on while I get a piece of blue paper. This is an AKA Becky's going to cheat. I'm not cheating. I am not going to cheat. So I'm just trying to get the bulk of this paste off of the stencil before I set it aside, and I'm probably going to actually... However, I am going to cut this paper. Do this. So I have a mister full water in my baby wipe, and I'm going to set the baby wipe over the top of it. All right, and I'm gonna spray it with some water. So, so nice I have a piece wet. of this, a chambray shirt that, that I'm going to do, use. And I'm gonna put, you know yeah, what? I better just cut it to size. Hold on. That would not be good because it's not gonna dry. Okay. So, next, I'm gonna okay. Because this is really all I'm gonna do with it. All right, so let's just put some of this on here. She gives me a credit card to use with no money on it. Okay, so we'll just stick it in here, get some, this modeling paste. And since we're not really directional, I'm going to use the new rustic rose. I guess we're just gonna put it on. You hoard everything. I do too, actually. <laughs> I just hoard it in an organized fashion so nobody realizes how much I'm hoarding. <laughs> Make sure all the little holes are filled and then wipe off okay. all so of the excess. This. Put the lid back on. Okay. And then when I lift it up, 
grab another baby wipe and wipe that off before Beth needs it. We just have this. I'm gonna set this aside to dry. Did you guys see it? Okay. Could I uh, have one as well, please? Thank you. Do you need a mister with water? I need a mister. I don't need any water. Get it? Get it? <laughs> okay, so now I got my paper all yucky. So if I just come over and start spraying you? <laughs> I don't need it. What are you misting? It, am I, so do I, I put, need to mist something? Well, what I did was I put my baby wipe over the top of the stencil and then misted it. So it would keep the any modeling paste that was left on the stencil damp. Guys, she tells us that now. I'm over her. I'm over her nonsense. That's it. Okay, let's get down to business here. We have some stamping to do, but we've got to stay off of that. Uh, oh, here it is. Oh, great. All right, you know what? We'll just wait until you're all done with that stamp that I got out and mounted. All right, we're gonna do the flowers first. We need to do the flowers. Look, I'm trying to grab stuff here because I'm going to use this. Set. Put this one on. Do you need the flowers, kiddo? No. Okay. And then, and then we're going to take this, the, die cut the umbrella. Cut. We're gonna ink it up in the chambray shirt. a great idea for this umbrella. So. Let's see if it actually works. Woohoo! Sure well, not the stamping, the thing, thing that I'm like thinking of. We know we can stamp. So. All right. Now I need to step over so to that. the platinum machine oh. and cut these out okay. with the coordinating dies. So you it's think about how we're going to use yeah. these papers with that strip and I'll be right back. Yay! Okay. Now I'm going to use this one just to practice lining this up. keep this in case we need it but Hi, Kathy. Um, we have our umbrella which is <laughs> die cut slightly okay, so crooked I'm go but who has time for perfection today right this. we know Sarah's gonna zip through this and we're gonna be behind where did you put the umbrella it's right here do you need it again an umbrella die oh I put it back haha <laughs> All of her paper but um Lies. no I don't want to kill all your paper <laughs> I'll just kill what I need we'll leave her with a whole bunch of little scraps ooh 
I'm seeing a challenge coming next season. With scraps? Oh, no. No, no. No, no. I'm thinking it would work. You just keep that a little to yourself. <laughs> okay. So let's put this on the bottom. We'll put this one on the top. And then... This guy will have to go across here. So far, so good. Stop looking. Get out of my business. I can't see it because your your iPad's blocking my. Oh well, thank goodness. I'm just you know making sure you're not cheating. I'm not cheating. You can even ask my friends. I am not cheating yet. I I think you've got your friends in cahoots with you. No. Mm -mm. Nope. We're good stampers. We we can follow direction. All right, guys, I'm going to use the bloom tool. And that's this fancy little tool that has stuff on both sides. This is to help you get the little stuff out of your dies when they stick in there. And it comes with all of these attachments. And we're going to take the largest one of these. You pull this back. You put this guy in here. And then you let it go. And now it's secure. So I'm going to turn this over on the mat. And I'm going to create some shape inside of it so that it's curved. So I'm going to start in the middle. Okay, maybe I got that in too far. I start in the middle and just kind of come out. And I'll show you in just a Forget minute what it's doing. I'm struggling to get it to work. Okay. So this is still damp. But I don't see how that's curling? So I don't know if you can see that or not. Okay, see how that's curling? Shot. So when I turn it over, it has some shape to it. Can you see that? I don't know if you pick that up or not. So it has some shape to it. So now when I put it on here, it kind of stands out. It's so like you can feel what's inside. That's kind of fun. All right, so we'll put all these back. And that's the bloom tool. Everybody needs a bloom tool. Okay, so let's take our flowers and some, some pencils. I'm going to use, do we want to use Journey Burst pencils or do we want to use watercolor pencils? Let me see if I have my watercolor brush with me. Oh, I do. I do. I do. I do. Okay, let's use watercolor pencils instead. Can I have a Thank you. All at your service, ma'am. Okay, so the Should Color I Splash pencils are the watercolor pencils. So, so we're going, we're to, going to just start with some greens in the background. I'm just realizing. And just color it in. I'm going to do these darker. Hi, Stephanie. Hi, Marie. Okay. Build so for those in. that are just coming in, whoops! Don't tell her we just broke our pencil. Bundle Oops. Today, and we had to use printed paper, washi tape. I might be hurrying. I could have pressed too hard. Don't tell her. All right. So and some greens, and then we have to use some colors that are complementary to this. So let's do. Do you hear her yellow. Trying to act like she knows about color theory? Nothing. I know nothing <laughs> about color theory. But by golly, I know how to color. I can stay in the lines with the best of them. So here's what I'm going to do for my pencils. I'm going to use them to add some shape in here. Okay, so we'll use that. And then so I'm going I'm to put a little orange yeah. around this. And a little bit in the middle here. And then I guess I'll just use I'm this orange up. on here. I don't really know if blue flowers exist. Do I want to do blue flowers? This is just what kind of blue is that? Light hand here through the center. The second tray and of I'm these going underneath. To it a little bit. I'm just gosh. Do blue flowers even exist? It? Do it really light, and then we'll go around it with some darker. We'll do this one blue and this one blue. So again, 
and just a very, very light hand because you just want a little bit of shadow. You don't want to have All right. a whole so now we're going to take our pencil or our, our blender some water. I just have it full of water and so I just squeezed it to bring the so water down into the barrel of the brush and now I'm just going to blend all of these colors. Oh my grace. This is I know she's going to zip through this and be done way dream. faster than we are so I'm not going to go back and do a ton of shading like I would you know if I was doing it for real. I've got to keep enough, up so with I this girl. To grab this one. So this is the full one. This actually provides a pretty natural looking get the rest of these shadow, filled in. Rather than using black, which can and be really then harsh. let's do the so yellow on the outside of these first and then the inside. Do we picked up some greens? And then we'll shadow. just smear this out. So it's bright. It's great for shading for living things. She's down there talking about living things? What are living things? Flowers and people and animals and Okay. So you got that extra in. So I'm gonna come up with this gray again. I'm gonna do some shading on this banner. All right, I'm gonna so pick some color up off of here. This back here. Sometimes when it's wet, it it's won't pick it up. Gray. And then which oh brother, which and blue did we have? It darker, like I think it was this one. And then again, I'm gonna add some gray and here. Pick up some of this blue. And wherever we'll go a little darker in here. There's that overlap. Not that very dark, gold. but that's okay. We we're gonna just stop. And then make that darker and then just kind of lighten up your hand as you're pulling it out, which gives it a little bit of a green coat. Alright, so now we have our flowers done, we have this done. Let's get some adhesive. Now remember that we have to stack. use Post some squares. washi tape. So, um, the foam squares, how do you know if this is dry without like touching it? <laughs> Who knows? All right, we got to put some washi tape on here. So I have to go find it. Do you have the washi tape? There's black or there's the sparkle somewhere over there. It's black? Like that paper. I'll, I'll take hello. the black. Let's use that. Okay. Oh, we'll have a today. little hint of color in this one. <laughs> you have no sound at all, Stephanie, or are you getting it now? Okay, so let's cut these off. See if I switch this. Is this helping at all? Are you guys getting a little bit now? Better we'll put this guy on top off. of here. That'll look good. Let's see if we can get any glue out of this today. Trying to watch. <laughs> okay, so we're gonna set this just a little off the filter. Okay, here. fine. And bring the. I'll use okay. some of this. And then we're going to take our... I need to just go home and just poke all of my adhesives and get them started again. Having use them only in this basket, I only use them every Monday. And I think that that's just not enough for them. Okay. Oh, we hope that was... Uh, <laughs> I really hope that's dry because I just smeared my finger all over that. Oh, your phone keeps buffering? Okay, let's go here. Peel I this have off. Like a really big delay right now, guys, because and I'm looking at it right now, and I'm just putting this the foam squares on, on the back of the umbrella. So there's a really long delay on my end. I don't want to press on that because I know that's not dry. Okay, so I'm gonna put that down. Okay. And you know what? This totally needs to be matted today. 
Okay, so now we're going to take our umbrella and we're going to put it on here, but we want it to um, have to keep its dimension, right? Because we made that shape into it. So we're going to just put a foam square at the bottom only. This is your I'm going to put it warning, on here. Two minute warning. Oh my God. Oh, okay. I can rise to the occasion. Okay, we can do it. We can do it. We can do it. So. Okay, so I'm going to put a foam square on the back of that, and I'm pretty, pretty sure I can I, fit I this in here. Put those flowers in there. Whoop, whoop, whoop. Okay, now we'll get back into our chambray shirt, and we're going to take these little hearts. So I'm coming out of here, here, here. So I'm just adding a little How about that? There the Those flowers need a lot more coloring and a lot more shading, it. but she's not going to give us any time. So, okay. So I need to mount so mine as well. So I'm going to cut some cardstock. I'll be right back. Put the umbrella and the banner on, but since we didn't pull it. That wasn't an option, but I think it turned out pretty cute. The shading looks cute. Good. I think we did good job this year. Oh man! <laughs> see what they're destroying my craft room. I no, it's my own, man. Even the dogs are looking to see what happened. <laughs> okay. So, I am going to actually. Oh, she's done. Look at us. We're done at the same time. I'm, I'm moving. I yelled slowly. at her last year because I, or last week, but I'm like, how do you get through that so fast? Come on, you have to wait for me. There's Sammy. Okay. And so I am going to here. turn you guys back around. So hold on. So hang on just a second. Let me get you back on the other mount. She's actually really snoring. Your dog is snoring? Yeah. I can't hear that. I, I totally can hear her. All right. Okay. Are we back in business? We are back in business. Okay, you're really going to like my... Okay, that's the rest of your craft room. <laughs> <laughs> okay. 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 So Bye. you're Bye. really going to like my card this week. Pretty sure. Look at how well I use the modeling paste. <laughs> it's cute, but you really did use just the smallest it's amount cute. you could get away with. It's cute. No, what, I like I like the what color. What do you want me to do with it? Learn how to use it. No, it's messy. It's yucky. Oh, like that? <laughs> <laughs> that's just white on white. Oh, that's kind of cute. You know, it's sort of cute. You can just go on over to Much Love Sarah and take a look at how she did hers. Or it's really cute. you can just stay right here. <laughs> yeah, no. All right, guys, as always, if you are watching this live on Inking Idaho, head over to Much Love Sarah's Facebook page to see how she used the, the products that we drew. And Much Love Sarah, come on over to Inking Idaho and take a look at what we did. And as always, guys, your job is to decide which one of us made the best use of the products this week. And I'm pretty sure it's me. Yeah, yeah, it is. I'm going to pay them. You, you need to get... <laughs> You need to get to a point where you're using more than a quarter inch. I used of it. I used the product. It. I used it. Okay, I did. Washi tape, pencils. I used a lot more of the pencils and the pattern paper. It balanced out. She's not getting off the hook. All right, guys. You, if you love this video, please share it with your friends, and we will see you next Monday. Have a great. <laughs> Have a great week. Bye-bye. <laughs> Much love to you all.